Hi, I'm Trinity Johnson, and I'm a eighth grader from Westside Middle School. It's an awesome Thanks. And this is my poem, Obese Denise. In health, we learn about eating disorders, and when the topic of anorexia and bulimia come up, the class consoles them. But when the topic of obesity surfaces, my fat rolls become an example to the class on how not to treat your body. And let's be honest, it's not just in health class, it's everywhere I go, and I have to listen to what my bullies tell me, because when I walk, the ground rumbles, that when I swim, I cause a tsunami. And that solar eclipse don't just happen every 72 months, but every time I walk by, my peers say, don't hate yourself. That beauty's on the inside, but my fat is so thick that it's impossible for people to see through. They say, I shouldn't worry. Ashley Graham's a fat model. I mean, Ashley's pretty, but what if I want to be Gigi Hadid? My friends tell me, you have such nice hair. And you should stop calling yourself fat. It's bad for your self-esteem. But also, you should do wrestling so you can crush your enemies. My gym teacher doesn't think I can run a 10-minute mile. He tells me that I have to wear shorts because I need to get over my insecurities, even though leggings protect my thighs from chafing, preventing the th friction that turns that 10-minute mile into week-long weeks of suffering sores. My family tells me that it's genetics, that all Archuleta women have bodacious curves, that men like thick girls, and we were blessed. The passive-aggressive sales clerk at Forever 21 tells me, the plus size section is that way because she thinks that long shirts and loose skirts work the best on my body type. Everybody tells me these things, but I already know that bullies don't walk the talk, and when I walk, I don't cause a natural disaster because I'm a natural pastor to the hymns of my starved stomach, which is the only rumbling coming from my body. I cannot roll my eyes in the back of my head. But how much prettier can my organs be than yours? My friends are just trying to be nice. But when I call myself fat, it's because I am. My family wants, to love me, wants me to love myself. Love the fat plastered to my body as they serve me a platter of enchiladas, and I don't know how to say no. They don't understand. I fear eating in front of other people, the wandering eyes of strangers judging the content of my plate, so I'll have the salad. My gym teacher tries to classify me as obese, even though the definition of the disease is a person who eats a lot and does not exercise. He does not realize I play basketball and skip meals. The stores cannot find the circumference of my torso impossible to solve. The clothes they create look like 70s curtains meant to cover up the things that you don't want people to see because the X in extra large is completely different than the X in sexy. My overhang does not make me overly confident because I'm convinced that being skinny is pretty, so I try by sucking in the rolls of my stomach instead of ingesting the ones that cause them, understanding that there's not much more I can do than know that their words may be tough. But hey, maybe all my extra fat will make those words bounce back. So people, what else would you like to tell me?